I'll take this 1v1. Nice push upstairs here. Oh. What the f? <laughs> Yo. Yo, man. What's up, brother? How you doing? Nothing much. Good. You? Doing all right. Not too bad. Ready to pop right. off. Uh, had bad raids yesterday, so I'm hoping. It's a new day, man. Yeah. You got it. All right, talk to me, man. This your first wipe? Uh, yeah, I started in January, I think. You started when the game just wiped? Yeah, yeah, around there. Okay, 30% survival rate. Run throughs. How do you describe your playstyle? I like to, so I play a lot of FPS games. I play like a lot of Valorant, CS, Siege, and all that. And in those games, I play like hella aggressive. Like, I, I, I don't like sitting and waiting. But I do think like sometimes that gets me killed because I would be too aggressive. But in this right. game, I try like slowing it down sometimes. But I don't know. I feel more confident when I'm aggressive. In this game. Yeah. Okay. What would you say is holding you back? Mechanics or just game sense? Uh, kind of game sense, and I guess a little mechanics like movement, like in your videos and stuff, and on stream, the way you peek around like a corner or something. Yeah. yeah. Like. I'm, I try doing it and I'm just kind of slow at it. Yeah, that's normal. Mechanics are very unique on this game. It take a while to get used yeah. to. Especially if you're fluctuating. Um, like if you go play Tarkov, move around and then play Battle, yeah. it's going to be a big difference. It's going to take longer to get used to it. Yeah, I play with like two other of my friends and they're also new. They, we all started at the same time. And uh, all right, hold on, let me focus up. Sense is fucked because of. People spawn behind you. Yeah, the forklift. Nice. Okay. Unlucky. Undying to your duo. <laughs> Unlucky that he landed the headshot. Yeah. You can you can tell he was lucky because he sprayed afterwards as well. I also hate that spawn. Yeah, so if I spawn there, I would just run where you was first looking okay i'd run around hit the corner or wait for him and hold or like take an angle go prone or something i'd okay. avoid standing in the open in the hallway like he was doing so it just makes it easier on his end to headshot like he was doing but if you are i didn't catch this report shitty ass spawn i would just beeline it to medic Can I get shot from the left though? Uh, not if you're quick enough. They spawn fire out. Okay. Even with the painkillers, you can move while taking painkillers, so you always want to be moving, especially if you got a shitty spawn. Yeah. So, while you're healing like that, right? Yeah. The whole sam whole area in sandbags was already clear, right? So, yeah. why would you lock yourself in an area that you don't know is clear or not to heal? So well, you gotta... the, the angle from D2, I just, if I, I don't know. I just See, didn't want them to come from that angle to come over here if the door is open i guess yeah but the difference is you've already cleared sandbags so you're better off healing in the area you've cleared rather than an area that you haven't plus the angle you're worried about people won't be able to hear you heal from there true oh, dead raiders Uh, I'll loot that. Yeah, raiders. For, I'll loot their pockets, take the grenades. Most of the raiders are gonna have grenades in their pockets all the time. I don't even know 
I'm looting this. Sure. Try pushing up into Black Pond. Damn. It's all good. Here's something above me, was it? I couldn't tell. There's no difference swapping between full auto and single, by the way. Recall is still the same. Where I make it? Yeah. There you go. Try getting into the habit of doing that with the scabs instead of full autoing and wasting your ammo. The way the scabs work is over time, the longer they aggro on you, the more precise their aim gets. So you kind of want to take your time, hit your one tab, two tabs. Pop the prop though, because I like to pre med just in case I'm in a fight. Yeah. What's your armor on? Army 37. 37, chilling. Since it was damage going into the raid, I would always keep an eye on it. If I do get yeah. shot. I'd, I'd push up to Black Pond. It's that way, right? Uh, or no, that's White Pond. The stairs. Yeah, okay. back where the raid is right. See if you can run into the guy that killed him. Dead lobby, right? These stairs or yeah, up the yeah. ramp? You can go either way. Stairs is faster. Yeah, he's there. I didn't even see him. Alright. So good. <clears throat> Saw him blend in with the background. Look, you forgot that the door was closed last time you cleared it. I didn't see him, all uh -huh. I saw was the door open. So you wanna you wanna take in information like that. Like if you close okay. the door behind you, remember you close the door. If the door yeah. is closed and it's open, remember that. Especially if if you're in areas like that. And the bunker is not hard to remember because there's only a few doors down there. Yeah. Oh, um does it matter what mags I run? Like does it really affect how I play? Or? Um so what you could do to find out is go to edit preset. Yeah. As if you was building the gun. And then put put a mag in there, for example. And then look at the stash change. All it will change is the ergo, and that's on every gun. So yeah, if you yeah. could put 60 rounders on on the AK-101, the ergo yeah, will drop yeah. by more. Okay. Like me, for example, I prefer more ergo because I'm a fast player. If you're not a fast player, ergo is not going to matter as much. But I like to peek corners quick. I like to ADS quick. So this is something that I would consider, yeah. The fuck? Okay. Yeah, right now you're just surrounded by raiders. EMCs are kind of on the outside, fighting the raiders to get in. Let me sell the laser. Oh god, I thought that was a kill shot. <laughs> fuck is up with that door? So the raiders, they have a specific route that they generally uh, okay. follow. So once you get used to it, you'll know which routes they take and what angles they're most likely setting up. It's a bad corner to hold. Hold more of an off angle.
Nice. Next one's playing against him. Fuck. He whiffed. He's gonna reload. Mm. Fuck. Yeah. <clears throat> it was good. The first half was good. I like that. Um, the, the last push, I wanted to say don't push, but I don't think you would have stopped yourself. So with things well, like I, that, yeah, go for it. Not, I was just, I knew he was going to reload, but yeah, I didn't make it in time. You tunnel visions. So yeah. I think you knew that in the back of your head, he can finish reloading by the time I make it out this door and see him. But because you caught him once with his pants down, I like to call it with the pants down because you caught yeah. him, he whiffed, he reloaded, he's panicking and ran away. But it doesn't mean he's not a threat still. Just because you caught him, caught him once doesn't mean he's gonna let it happen again so you made yourself an easy yeah, kill yeah. coming out the door like that so if if you would have waited held the door where you killed the first one guaranteed he would have swung it and you would have killed him on top of his teammate's body okay so you don't think i should have pushed i should have stayed where i turned on power in that room yeah 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 uh right here i'll say this is a bad angle because you're stationary if someone swung yeah. out this you you're not winning that even me i'm not winning that because peak is advantage and they're a moving target and you're stationary i would have played patient i wouldn't have ran back i would have stuck my ground because all you're doing is giving him free space space yeah. and you just killed his teammate so most of the time they're gonna push off each other's contacts and you can hear him running up i already knew for a fact he's gonna push you so you're you're more than chilling right now fam you wasted what 10 rounds maybe hold more of an off angle So you don't think I should have reloaded there? Or? No. Okay. So right there, you have half a mag. Nice. That's more than enough to kill somebody. So you ran back. Running back into office is fine, but you look like you're trying to run away altogether. But you don't have anywhere to go. So you kind of panic. Yeah, you panic over here. You're trying to get away. Then you reload. And he I... pushed up off the contact. You're lucky he didn't kill you here. He whiffed. Yeah. I wanted to get into the other side of the office uh, to just like reset the fight, I guess. <laughs> but I, did, I f didn't even know that was blocked right there for some reason. Yeah, 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 it's all good. Even if you did have space, I still wouldn't say back up. Okay. All right, so the way I'll do it is pretty quick. So if you just want to chase me around, I'll show you. Yeah. yeah. Or if you want to watch my streams up to you. I'll watch it. Yeah. All right, so I'll clear that. Clear this angle. Clear that one. Next one. And now all I have left to worry about is this because I'm not exposed to anything aside from everything I already cleared. Okay. So I'm free to clear this. If I'm feeling like somebody's close, I'd run back. I'd free look over here, jump over here. What that does, if you want to replicate that real quick, and I'll show you what that so, does. Uh, uh, okay, clear, swing there. Should I? Now, if I feel like someone's there, should I full swing? Or if I yeah. know someone's there, can I just wall them? No, you can't shoot that door. It's metal. I can't? No, no. So look. Okay. So just remember that. No, I'm tripping. Okay. So just, it ties back into the situation in office. It's yeah. literally the same thing, but different environment. Even if they're elevated, it doesn't matter if they're all the way up. Swing it, bro. Because they not yeah. killing you for shit. There's no way. Swing it. And then once you killed him and someone's there, I'd run back, reset, reload. So that way you're reloading and cover if the, he does have a teammate. Yeah. Yo, if you're interested on getting coached in Tarkov, I am doing one-on-one -on -one coaching now. So if you're interested on why I play the way I do, you can head down to the description and sign up for coaching. Or if you want more information, click the link below that. Good luck with your raids. And also I'm live on Twitch like right now.
Really? He's not gonna peek there? Oh. 